We all know what flow feels like. We've all been there, focusing on something we love, deeply ingrained in the past, completely forgetting about the world around us, and actually creating something powerful. Yet, what if I told you there were things in your lifestyle that could be impeding the rate at which you attain this miraculous state of mind? And why entering a state less could, in a way, mean a worse mental health for you? For those who are unaware, the flow state is what we call this mental state we enter once we lose track of time and completely focus on a task at hand. Mostly associated with a state of bliss and complete joy afterwards. Now, it's been determined that certain factors are necessary, or certain criteria are necessary in order to enter a state. First of all, the task at hand needs to be difficult enough to challenge us. Meaning, if the task is really simple and we simply brush it off and do it m mindlessly, your mind will need to focus on it and you want it to a deep state of focus necessary for the flow. Secondly, the person focusing on the task needs to possess the ability to concentrate and focus for long stretches of time. This is to Increase the odds of encountering the state of flow. Meaning, if you focus for long periods of time, it is much more likely for you to, somewhere in those two hours, enter a state of flow. Meanwhile, if you can only focus deeply for three minutes, the odds are less on your side. And of course, certain people can access this flow easier, meaning they need to focus longer in order to reach it, but for most people, it is it is encouraged to have a better focus in order to increase your odds of entering the state. Now, obviously, many things can affect your ability to focus. Mainly, you could train your ability to focus in order to achieve greater lapses of time. Um, this could be done by purposefully, intensely focusing on the task, or meditation, whatever works for you. And other factors, such as biological factors or depression, could lower your ability to focus. And lastly, the last factor that could influence the rate at which you enter flow, other than the challenge of the past, and your personal ability to focus, would be your state of mind and how you perceive the task at hand. Your attitude towards the task at hand greatly influences your ability to enter flow. Meaning, the ability itself does not block the odds of you entering the flow. Your perception of it and your mind state while doing it seems to be much more important. Meaning, if you're to work and it kind of sucks, it, you're not necessarily forced into a normal state of mind. If you enter work with the right mindset, it is much easier to enter flow. Now, the mindset appropriate for entering flow is to be selfless, meaning to not have a strong ego holding you back, which can be thought, I guess, or change with affirmations or whatnot, and also a great sense of confidence. This could be done with <laughs> the classic power poses or also internal affirmations. Now, on top of the increased productivity on the task at hand, entering the state of flow might leave you with a great mental health. Why is that? Well, because the intense joy accompanied by entering the state of state, the state of flow, <laughs> might create some long-lasting mental benefits. The studies on this are lacking, but it is undeniable that entering the flow state is greatly pleasurable and satisfying for everybody. <laughs> So what I recommend doing is incorporating those little habits that might increase your odds of entering the state of flow. One on my part, I'll practice longer sessions of meditation as it's been proven to increase your odds of entering the state of flow. On top of that, I'll maybe incorporate some positive affirmations such as 
I guess that boosts my self-confidence before practicing something that requires great focus. And on that note, thank you for watching. Hope you learned something useful today. If you enjoyed this video in any kind of way, feel free to leave a like down below and to subscribe for more videos that can improve your life. Ciao people, I'll see you in the next video.